In the first episode of Heavy Trucking, we have a spectacular transport assignment. It involves a 50-ton house, an FH-16, two large cranes, and a persistent work crew. The objective is to move this daycare centre a distance of one kilometre, while keeping it intact so that the kids in Borstahus in Sweden can enjoy it in its new location. A lot of preparation has been done by Connie the boss and his crew. Roads have been closed, signs taken down, and several large girders have been placed underneath the house to prevent it from falling apart. And here we have the truck, a Volvo FH16. It is custom built with five axles. Two driven, two steering, and one self-steering. Having already clocked up over 92,000 kilometers in its lifetime, this faithful truck is the perfect heavy hauler for the job. The trailer is one of a kind, custom made with five dual lever suspension axles that are hydraulically controlled. This means that every wheel has its own independent suspension that keeps the load level at all times. Finally, we're ready for the lift. In addition to the actual transportation, the lift is a crucial part of this assignment. Heavy winds could risk the whole operation. One 50-ton house still intact, safe and secure on the trailer. Off we go. The speed is slow. Really slow. With narrow roads and with the risk of damaging the house, they need to be gentle. So far it's been a pretty smooth ride, but then the crew find themselves in a tricky situation. A 90 degree turn. Time for the driver to show some of his manoeuvring skills. Lucky they brought the guy with the chainsaw. Just one more branch. Oh, go on, one more. Oh, come on. After some nerve-wracking hours, the team manages to reach the drop site. Now they only have one shot of putting the house on the ground before it gets too dark. The fate of the house yet again lies in the hands of the crane operator. Together the crew must fit the corners of the house by hand. How's about that for teamwork? And there it is. One house that has travelled one kilometre in ten hours. Not bad. Let's hope the kids will enjoy their new daycare centre. It certainly looks like they'll have a nice view. Don't forget to keep track of Volvo Trucks YouTube channel for more trucking videos.